History was made today as the first female chief of defense staff was sworn in. Anthony Lug has the details. I, Antoinette Sandra Lee Weems Gorman, do swear that I will well and truly serve the people of Jamaica. A historic moment at Jamaica House on Thursday. Rear Admiral Antoinette Weems Gorman was sworn in as Chief of Defense Staff of the Jamaica Defense Force. Your outstanding track record, your history of firsts, and trailblazing career to date speaks to your suitability for this post. I am confident that as you build on the foundation of your predecessors, you will continue to serve with distinction. In delivering her speech on Thursday, the new JDF head promised accountability from the Jamaica Defense Force under her leadership. Throughout my tenure, I will not compromise on the integrity of the force, nor flout the long-standing, hard-won trust of the Jamaican people. Each service member will be held accountable for his or her actions, and they can be assured of my commitment to the good administration and welfare of the force. With over 30 years of service to the JDF, Prime Minister Andrew Holness says Rear Admiral Williams Gorman's experience in the Coast Guard will be an asset. Mr. Holness pointed to efforts being made to secure the country's borders. She will therefore bring a unique perspective to our discussions and our efforts to strengthen our borders and prevent illicit inflows to protect the lives and livelihoods of our coastal communities and to ensure that Jamaica can derive sustainable benefit from our maritime resources. As we continue our fight against crime and violence, the JDF will continue to play a critical role in support of the JCF. As a small country, we must continue to employ all available resources to address the number one threat to our collective future. Rear Admiral Antoinette Weems Gorman succeeds Lieutenant General Rocky Mead, who retired after serving the JDF for more than 38 years. Anthony Log, TVJ News.